Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to see how we can create the branches in Azure DevOps, how we can, I mean, what should be the naming convention for the branch and how we can create, I mean, how we can name a branch and basically how we can delete the branches, right, from Azure DevOps. So let's switch over to our Azure DevOps screen and if you see here, I'm using the project My Demo project and uh, in the last video I have cloned the same project in the Visual Studio Code, okay. So if you see here, currently I have only one, one branch okay or you can see it from here as well right so for this project currently i have only one branch and uh, so there are there are basically two ways to create the branches the first way is in the visual studio code you can directly go you can click over here and you can select create new branch from here or you can go to the source control option click three dots go to branches and then the uh, create branch from option you can use right now now the question is like how we can name our branch right so in most of the project if i if you talk about me uh, we generally use feature name right to develop any branch or to, to create any branch or if you don't uh, if you're not working on specific feature let's suppose you are a, uh, you are a qa like me uh, today, then in that case you can directly use your name right or or any teammate name whosoever is a maybe maybe the lead name or, or something right so uh, for this demo i will use one from uh, feature name let's say login feature okay and i'll take uh, take the reference of this login feature from master branch okay so whatever there is in the master it will go it will come inside the login right so if i see here even though i'm in the login branch i i can see all the files available right now the branch is created in the, my local system actually so if i see here in the azure devops still i will not get to see that branch right because the change is whatever i did is it's, it's still in my local now i want the branch should be published right in the devops to publish this branch i can i need to again click on these three dots and i'll go to branches and i need to select publish branch right so as soon as publish my branch and i'll see here the branch name you can see over here right so this is the default branch and this is my branch how i how i know that this is my branch you can directly go to again repo normal it will redirect to the file and if you click over here you'll see this is the master branch right and this is a local branch which is which i have created and i am going to work on it right so this is the first way you can create a branch now the second way is you can click directly from here you can name a branch let's say main screen or something right and uh, again it is it is taking a reference of master branch so whatever is there in the master it will come into this branch if i see here the branches are created now let's go to the visual studio code and if i try to switch over to this branch i'll not get to see this branch right now i need to fetch this detail right i need to pull the detail whatever detail is there in the master or in the in the Azure top right? So you can use pull from okay, and then you can use master. So whatever changes will be there, you can see it here, and or you can do sync basically, right? So once you do this, you'll get an option for the third branch also. See here, and now you can move or you can you can uh, switch over to the third branch the main branch basically the main screen which we have created just now right now the last topic for this video is i mean it's, again it's a very small video but i'm i'm covering very small topics so that it will be easy and people will not get bored yeah so if you wanted to delete this branch you can directly go over here in the branches page and you'll have an option to delete a branch or rename a branch or yeah you can delete a branch from here so as soon as you delete the branch you'll not get to see that branch again right see you have only one branch left thank you thanks a lot for watching this video